King Reed, mm -hmm. he can introduce himself to you. Yeah, like he said, um, I'm from Trenton. I represent NBF. I'm saying. What does NBF stand for? Never, for betray, never betray family. Okay. Gotcha. Like mm -hmm. that. It's a whole movement. I've been doing this for about like a year, just last month. So, I really, just want to get into music. I don't, you know, I don't like talking like that. Right, right, right. So He's a shy song? guy. What's the first song? First song with uh, Lil Nizzy, Doghouse. So you just What's play the IJ? his verse, his uh, verse, King Rick and Bia. Yeah, I ain't even putting him in my track. I got the set, I got the set. I hit a mat, what was you saying? What was you saying? Solos, though. I just brought that joint because. Of course, I you really, should, as yeah, you should. Feel me? As you should. That's one of the joints I had last year. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That's the one. 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 That's the one.
This for them days I was hungry, baby needed my coat Gotta go get me some money, rob a nigga for his work Get a phone, get a jumper Get a phone, get a jumper Get a phone, get a jumper This for them days I was broke This for them days I was hungry, baby needed my coat Gotta go get me some money, rob a nigga for his work Get a phone, get a jumper Get a phone, get a jumper Get a phone, get a jumper This for them days I was broke I grab a break, some dope Met some players like I got plugged in My old head showed me the ropes I was laid up on the bounce Fuckin' something gotta go I don't wanna hear that bullshit Tell me something I don't know Started flippin' now I'm raggin' up Niggas funny boy I'm crackin' up And funny money in the streets My homie bustin' they start actin' up Go my heart that ain't no sackin' up I'm in the front and I ain't backin' up I came in the game killin' niggas They movin' on I see them crackin' up I don't really do the talkin' Spaz out to let the hawkin' Niggas out here on that stupid shit Got on loose but they walkin' I ain't got no time for stallin' Take my phone if you want it This for them days I was hungry I'ma go take me some money This, this for them days I was broke This for them days I was hungry Baby nigga in my coat I got a whole fucking line up of these though That's the crazy Alright, let's get this critique going Alright, so first one I already heard, it's mm -hmm. a good record for you with Nizzy and the video do good with the numbers. What's the numbers at now with Nizzy? It's at like 70,000. 70,000. Um, that's a good record. Mm -hmm. Number two is your record. Number two. No, you pay. I just dropped that like six days ago. For real. That's your record? Yeah. That's you. I, I I agree to that more. And just like you said, number three is the record. To a DJ, mm -hmm. it's not the record. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? What, what y'all feel is cool. Right. You know what I'm saying? But for us to be in the club or us to be in an atmosphere where it makes sense, mm -hmm. number two will make a nigga be like, right. what, what the fuck is this before number three? Mm -hmm. So me personally, if, if it was me, you know what I'm saying, in my... Her expertise with this shit. Right. <laughs> Number two is your fucking record. Yeah. No, That's where that. you need to. That video got to be you walking down them streets mm. with this girl. I, I was visualizing the whole, the whole shit. Yeah, yeah. So you, that video got to be out the door. Like it got to make so much sense. Right. You understand what I'm saying? So to me, like I said, number two is your record. You know what I'm saying? Yankee. I would spend number one. I fuck with number two. I fuck with number. Actually, number three is like one of my favorite. But I would spin number one inside my playlist. Right, That's right. definitely. Nope. Kurt. <laughs> Gotta elaborate on what I said earlier. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yes, number three is a good record. Yeah. It's a street record. Right. If you looking for the bigger picture than just being a street artist. Right. Number two is your record because it appeals to both sides right. of the spectrum. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's okay? Right. Now, he let off with the video idea. Since you leaned on number three, the storyline of number two could lead into number three. Right. Mm -hmm. Gems. Just like I said before I even heard the track, that, that song could be the B-side of your record. Yep, mm -hmm. yeah, that's what I was going to say. And that could be your next single. That could lead, to, lead you to that next single, that being your next single. Right. But two is your lead, two is your lead. If you want radio spins, two is two, your two lead. Is your right, right, right. Both I didn't you. like two, because he was talking about us. Like, like no. I think it was dope. It, it's with, yeah, with what he's saying as far as it being versatile and appealing to both women and men, it's mm -hmm. definitely gonna go off. One is crazy. Three was dope too. Like you sound, you so Philly mm -hmm. to me. Mm -hmm. I hear, that, that's what I hear, but I'm, I'm rocking with all of them. But, Young I'm rock with all three records, but two is definitely, you know, that's the one. Yeah. Definitely for radio, working in the club, working the radio. Mm -hmm. I mean, you want something that's gonna work everywhere. That record right there grabs attention as soon as you hear it. Right. Um, three definitely a banger, but you know, I mean, that's the that's like in the '87 range in the club when you turn it down a little bit, like niggas is just in there bopping. Mm -hmm. right. That's where I see that record, but two is when I need to turn, mm -hmm. and that's what you want. I rock with one, two, but those two, two and three is the ones. I thought uh, one and two were fire. 
Um, but I definitely like the DJ said, like go with number two. It's just easier for us, and like you could just do so much more with that record. Mm -hmm. And like you have that sound that the youth's going for right now. Right. My only critique is just don't get too caught up in that. You know what I mean? You don't want to get trapped in that same sound, sounding like everybody. Right. You want people to like hear something else too. You know to know that you got range with you. Yeah. But uh, I thought the music was fire. I think you know for you to only be doing this a year, mm -hmm. right? Wow. <laughs> I'm, I'm looking yeah. forward to seeing where you're going, man. Right. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, uh, Far away. Def definitely number one. That's a big song. Mm -hmm. that, that means that it can be played anywhere. Mm -hmm. Radio, street, clubs, parties, block parties. It don't even matter. Right. And uh, number three, like you said, with the bop, and you know, just rocking out. Everybody's just rocking out. Right. Definitely number one. Number two. And I'll just add on to um, what I was going to say. Out of everything sounds good, I just want you to lay off the auto tune a little bit. Mm -hmm. Because your transition going from you rapping to you singing is like the same. It it, it kind of like. I didn't even know that it was both you. <laughs> it, mm. you I thought you had a I'm feature. Right. Honestly, I, the whole and, time I thought somebody else, it was somebody else. So, but the, the music sound good though. It's right, engineered yeah. real well. Right, so, right. so me, I, I I mean, you don't have to. It's, it's your discretion. But mm. you know what I'm saying? Like the, the, you just gotta also remember something. When you do an auto tune, I tell artists all the time. When you do an auto tune, you do anything live. It doesn't sound the same. Right. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? You yeah. cannot auto tune at a show. Unless you got you money. Unless you, <laughs> <need those. laughs> Unless you got money. Uh, you understand what I'm saying? Boy, so it's too much. Yeah. So yeah. just just try to, because every artist auto tunes. Mm -hmm. There's no rapper, nobody you're around that's not auto tuned. Mm -hmm. So just sometimes if the hook is auto tuned, lay off of it on your verse. Right. Not saying don't put it, but. Yeah. Lay off it a little bit because you have a distinct voice too. Right. Mm -hmm. So your voice might just stand out a little bit more. Yeah. Right. You understand what I'm saying? But you do sound good and you do rock the auto tune well. That's my critique. Anything you want to say to the DJs? Follow me. You know what I'm saying? I want, I want all y'all to follow my journey. I got, like I said, I got a big ass catalog full of shit like this. Like, two of them three tracks was on my mixtape when I first dropped last year. You feel me? I got a whole catalog of new shit. I just really wanted to. I asked. I asked New Era, you feel me, New Era and Westfield, they fuck with me heavy. So I asked them which ones to put on there, which, which ones I should bring. He really, they ain't hear none of my new shit. I just been building lately, you feel me? But you gotta also remember, you, you, you have, who in this room do you know besides I me? Mean, I think I, I follow you on the gram, but I don't know nobody else. You though. follow me? Yeah. Right, so my whole personal thing is, what that is saying is that you don't know these people. Mm -hmm. This is what this is about. You right. gotta, you gotta. Yeah. Build your relationships. You know Wes. You know Nuera. Mm -hmm. You know me. Now you know Farway. You know Rick. You know uh, Young Hitter. You know Kurt. You know Yankee. You know what I'm saying? Like now it builds your catalog. So now you could be like, you know, I'm about to go to North Philly. Who can I call? Damn, I can go see Kurt. I can go see um, Farway. Damn, psh, I want to go to Jersey. Psh, I can go see Young Hitter. Right. When you have relationships now, when nigga play your record, mm -hmm. when you ain't got no relationship, and nigga like, nigga, you got to call for the brown to fuck yes, who you with. Right? Sure. <laughs> and niggas be thinking that, and that's why I, that's why I was trying to tell your uncle what I was telling him, like, yo, he has to understand that he has to fuck with the DJs, yeah. because he's gonna come around, and he's gonna come back and see me. Right. And guess what? You were here, coming to see me. What's your That's name? What we you said you follow me already? Yeah, King Reek NBF. So follow him back, DJ. I'm about to find him.